What is going on guys, my name is Chaotic and welcome back to another Grand Theft Auto 5 video. Now in today's video, I'm going to be discussing a secret update which may be making its way into Grand Theft Auto Online sometime soon in the next few days or weeks. So let's go ahead and get straight into things. Now first of all, you may recall roughly a week ago or so, the current double money and RP opportunity was leaked online by GameSpot by accident after receiving the information early from Rockstar. Shortly afterwards, they took the article down, but the event did take place and is still taking place in GT Online and will last all the way until this Thursday. Anyway, the point which I'm trying to make is, usually, double money and RP opportunities only take place after an update has been released. But sometimes in the past, you may recall we have seen special event weeks and weekends take place just randomly out of nowhere, and the week after, we then receive an update. And that's exactly what I think this current double money and RP opportunity is leading us up to. A new update which may become available sometime very soon, maybe as early as next week or the week after. But this is just a theory, there is no official information even confirming this, so don't go getting your hopes up just yet. But there is some new information to back up this theory, suggesting there is a new update on the way for Grand Theft Auto Online. So two days ago, on February the 23rd, there was an update for the Grand Theft Auto iFruit app on iOS devices. Now to most people this may not be very surprising to you, and you may not think it's anything very special. At the end of the day, this may just be an update fixing a few bugs or glitches with the iOS app, but what you may not be aware about is that more often than not in the past, Rockstar has updated the iFruit app, adding the new content for the future DLCs to this iOS app before it's even added into GTA Online. And like I said, we have seen this a number of times in the past, and this is exactly how many of the updates in the past were leaked, such as the Lowriders update, the Executives and the Criminals update, and so on. And sometimes the new content which is going to be added with the next update in GTA Online is added to this iFruit app months before the update itself is even released into GTA Online. And this is exactly how many times in the past we're aware of which items, vehicles and stuff like that is coming to each update before Rockstar announces anything, all through this iFruit app. And this new update was supposedly adding some additional content support for GTA Online. Now the way this statement has been worded would suggest something has been added to the iFruit app with this update which isn't available yet in GTA Online. But right now unfortunately it is unknown what this new content is that has been added to the iFruit app. So I guess we'll have to wait and see on that one, but I will try and keep you guys updated. But what we do know is that whatever this update may be, it could potentially be very, very big. As you guys can see in the screenshot, this update was 129 megabytes in size, which may not seem like a lot, but for an app update, it would be considered very big. Far too big to fix a few bugs or glitches in the app. But like I said, I guess we'll have to wait and see. But I want to get your thoughts and feelings on this. What do you guys think about this? Do you guys think this is some form of hidden update which is yet to be announced by Rockstar for GTA Online? Or is it just some form of software update for the app or something along those lines? So go ahead and leave a comment on this video giving me your thoughts and feelings. It would also be greatly appreciated if you guys could also take a few seconds out of your day to click the like button as it helps me out a lot. And if you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel, ready to recommend that you do because I upload all the latest and the greatest Grand Theft Auto 5 content. So once again, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys next time.